All right, right back where we left off. Let's go, ladies and gents. I just go out to play games. Thank you guys for being here with me. You basically gave him my gun. Here you go, Frank. You can't keep getting mad at me, especially for stupid shit. I'm not mad. It adds up in my mind as people letting me down. And I just liked having that gun, man. You didn't need it, though. Now you have me to protect you. I'm just glad you were here. Me too. I think. Chloe, why the hell are you hanging around scary losers like Frank? It's weird. Let's take a break and I'll talk. Alright, that's what she says. Feels like a different world, huh? I wish we could stay forever. Can we build another pirate fort and keep the world out? We need a new secret hangout. At least Frank wouldn't find us. Are you okay, Max? Frank. Seriously, Chloe, this is scary. What if Frank tries to track us down? I'm sorry, but Frank isn't as hardcore as he fronts. All he cares about is his cash, stash, and mangy dog. Chloe, are you for reals? Frank just took your gun and threatened us. He's armed and clearly dangerous. Max, I know. Crazy shit is the new normal for me. That's why I plan to leave Arcadia Bay without paying Frank off. Now, tell me exactly what's going on between you and Frank. Does he have a last name? Frank Bowers, he's just a dealer, where I get my weed. The one in your joint, remember? Anyway, Frank and I kind of hung out. Hung out? Hung out? You don't mean you... Ah, oh, no, we didn't have sex. Gross, man. He never even tried. I just made the mistake of borrowing money so Rachel and I could bail out of here. All right, fair enough. No. I want to know how Frank got Rachel's bracelet. What do you think? <laughs> My brain is fried. I don't fried. know anymore. My brain is so fried from all of this. I need a mental enema. Ah, it's so weird talking to you about this insane crap. We haven't hung out this much since we were tweens, and it's like no time has passed. I wish Rachel was here to meet you. Rachel and I? Do you I? think that Rachel and I would have been friends? You're not Let's that go. different. She had... has a great eye for images and for art. Plus, she's a smartass like you. We would all be hella best friends forever. I know she must be as cool as you are. I have no doubt we'll meet soon. Railroad tracks always make me feel better. I have no idea why. Carol, I honestly you know. don't either. It's the romance of travel and movement. The sound of the train whistle at Look night. Look at the beat poet here. I'd rather be a good photographer. You are. You just have to stop being afraid. Hmm. she is. Let me guess the train is coming now. What's yep. that noise? The train. Oh shit. Okay, what I'm supposed to do here. Ah, uh, fuse box. Awesome. It's not locked. Come on, Max. Oh dude, what the heck? I better find a tool to cut those wires. What the heck? I don't even know where the train is, dude. I've never been so nervous in nope, my life. I don't want to go there. I can't even 
Oh, dude. Oh, dude. Yeah, let's go all the way back. Even further, please. Okay. All right, so we need a tool. I don't want to go that way. Well, then where do I find the tool, dude? I don't want to go that way. I couldn't speak to Chloe. Oh, dude, what the heck? Wait, wait, what is that? Nothing. The train's coming! Max, please! Get me out of here, Max! With what? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Shit, I can't budge it at all! Use this bad boy. Okay. I'm gonna keep rewinding until we get this right. Score. Uh, sick. Okay. You're lucky I can freaking fast forward time. Wire cutters. Now I can pull a total MacGyver. Blocking the drum. What is blocking the drum? Please get me out of here. Crap, I can't push that. Okay. Dude, I'm at the gist. But which wire to cut? Yellow. Whoa. Short Circuit City. Max, get me out of here! I can't even move it with this crowbar? For real? Please! Get me out of here! I can't even move it an inch. Oh, dude, that's it? Okay. Which wire to cut? Now that's the right cable. Sick. Yes! I did it! The level of stress this episode okay? put me in from the you very beginning. You saved me again! Crazy! Now we're totally bonded for life. That was close. Oh my god, dude. Aren't you glad I took you away to a nice, quiet, desolate spot? It was cool to spend time in your lair, but I have to get back to school before my next class. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. My powers might not last, Chloe. That's okay. We will. Forever. There's probably a photo opportunity there somewhere that I missed, but to be honest with you, I don't care. Um, oh, also, if you're new, welcome. If you're not, welcome back. Please, 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 like and subscribe to the tribe. This is Life is Strange, Thanks this is the remastered right, version. Play. Let's right get on it. time for my art lesson. Thanks for coming with me. Sorry to be so boring. Nothing exciting ever happens to us, right? Listen, your rewind power has to be connected to that snow yesterday. That might explain your tornado vision. Oh. Explain what? Explain what? Snow equals the ginormous twister that takes out Arcadia Bay? You're high. Wake no, up, she's Max. Not. You saved my life twice now. You altered the course of my destiny, yours, and whoever. Do you know about chaos theory? Uh, what do you know? Yeah. What do you know about chaos theory, Miss I Hate Math? Five years ago, asswipe. 
some people change. Fair enough. And your situation is the perfect storm for quantum physics. Why me? I'm just a geek girl in some small town. A perfect example of strange attractors? Don't they teach you kids anything at Blackwell? We have a tornado, rewind power, and freak snow. Hello, Armageddon. So let's party with your power, Rockstar! Like he said, Professor Price, a superhero needs a sidekick. How can it be such a shitty week and yet one of the best of my life? Because we're back in action again. I have a feeling with the side between either Warren or Kate here. Dude, it's tough. I just have a feeling. I just have a feeling. If I if I was to design a design a game, that's what I would do. I would choose like either there'd be a scenario where I either go hang out with Warren or I hang out with Kate, you know? Alright, now I'm at school. I must be late because it was like nine something, dude. What time I have does a little time start? before Mr. Jefferson's class, so I can do some wandering. Well no, this is college. Okay. Alright, so we do a little wandering here. Let's see if anything over here has changed. Map. Have the sweetest outfit. Uh, it doesn't, doesn't appear to be. Let's look at uh Wait, posters. What are you looking at? If I was normal, I'd be super excited about going the world to a major party. shindig. That's kind of interesting that they named it the end of the world party. Yeah, that's kind of interesting. Huh. Speak Sir? with the principal. Oh, hello, Max. I hope this isn't about the alleged gun incident. To talk to Nathan. Alleged? Nathan did have a gun. Have you talked to him yet? Yes, he's deeply upset about this accusation. I don't blame him. Once I have all the facts, we'll talk. For the moment, focus on your schoolwork. I can't focus when I'm scared. Please don't say that. There's nothing to be scared of at Blackwell Academy. Whatever, Our head dude. of security is overseeing a new era of campus safety. Mr. Madsen already treats everybody here like they're under surveillance. Wait, wait. Do you see a pattern here, Max? Probably not the same one you see. It's very easy for you to instantly accuse people of doing terrible things. Nathan, Mr. Madsen, who's next? Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a meeting. <laughs> this guy. Ah, dude, if I could hit people in games. I, I would be threatened, you know, I, I would I would want to just just a little bit, you know, just, just, just lay a hand on R2, you know what I mean? All right, let's see what we Join have here. Us or die. End of the world party again, man. OK. And who is this? Hey, Courtney. Ciao, Max. No photos, please. I have to come up with a guest list for a Vortex Club soiree. Really? Oh, like you care. I I'm do. not anti soiree. You seem anti-fashion, though. A Vortex Club party has a strict dress code. Do you even have a dress? <laughs> Sorry, but nice try. Fair enough. So they need dresses to get there. Cool. That snow was so this insane. is Sammy. Seriously. Is that Hello, Victoria? Who is this? Yo, girl with the glass is kind of cute. Not gonna lie, okay. Um... I'm not gonna read all those. I'm not gonna read that. I will speak with Zachary though. Hello, Zach. What's up, Max? It's weird to not see you without your camera. I'm always taking pictures with my eyes. I bet. As long as you don't talk to everybody about all that shit with the sext in Victoria. I won't. I won't. That's what Victoria wanted. Yeah. I noticed she kind of set up her own drama, even if it fucks her over. Weird. She doesn't have to, though. That's what I don't get at all. When she's hot, rich, talented, what more does she need? Anyway, okay. see all you right. at the game Friday, Max. All right, dude sounds like a douche, but you know, whatever. I think it's Dana who's Black into Wolf it. Blackwell sure so. takes its swimming seriously. But otters are cute. We've Go otters. Of... I think we've seen, oh, wait a minute, is this new? You can really learn a lot about a school by the weird shit posted on the boards. Maybe not. Maybe that was up there the first episode when we looked. Let's see what else we got here. Trevor's on the phone. 
Uh, I can speak today. Okay. Excuse me, Mr. Madsen? I know things got a little heated yesterday in Chloe's room. Was that really your reefer? See, now I said I was going to be honest, dude. I said I was going to be honest. And I feel like he, again, he has surveillance in the house, so he already knows the truth. I'm going to say no. No, it belonged to a friend of mine. Are you going to bust me now, Mr. Madsen? Even I'm not that much of an asshole. And I am sorry about yesterday. I was wrong, but upset. Cannabis is not a big deal to you. But it has been to Chloe. You're a combat veteran. She's no threat to you. If I didn't care about her, I wouldn't care at all. When I was her age, I was out raising a lot more hell. She's better than that. Yeah. All you kids are. So is Kate Marsh. Um, you treat Kate bad. But you treat Kate pretty bad. You step between us at a pretty bad time. She's another matter entirely. Kate hasn't done anything wrong. Max, this isn't just about Kate Marsh. My concern is for the safety of all Blackwell students, including you. That'll take Dude. more than surveillance cameras. It will take more than Ms. Grant and her petition to find missing students. Isn't that oh, your okay. responsibility as head of security? Unless you know something about Rachel Amber that nobody else does. I don't want to fight with you anymore. I don't want to fight with anyone anymore. That's all, Max. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. He kind of won me over a little bit with that. Like with that one, he kind of won me over I just a little bit, man. Yeah, he kind of won me over with that conversation. I think I think I finally get his motivation for why he's doing what he's doing. All right, Warren is texting some stuff. Sit down, signs. Okay. All right. I still have time. I could go see Warren playing mad scientist in the lab. I saw Victoria yeah, we could. shopping for the party. That reminds me to the science class over there. But really quick. Speak to Evan. Yo, Maxwell Smart. Talk later, cool? Yeah, Evan. Might as well. So you can't you help me? You have to talk to me. I'm trying. But you have to understand my position. Wait, what happened? You don't understand. No, 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 I didn't want to go all the way back that far. Mr. Jefferson, you just don't get it. Just leave me alone. You have to talk to me, Kate. Why? It's all over, like me. Knock off this martyr crap. What do you want from me? I want you to be honest. Nobody believes me anyway. Stop acting so brittle. Being on a viral video does that. Maybe this is your way of getting attention. Wait, what? That's really mean, Mr. Jefferson. You just don't get it. Just leave me alone. You have to talk to me, Kate. Why? It's all over, like me. Knock off this martyr crap. What do you want? From Excuse me, Max. Can you come over here? Oh, I see. I'm not important to you anymore. Nobody cares about me. Nobody. Just between you and me? I'm worried about Kate Marsh. That's no secret. Word on the street Can't is go that back. you and Kate had a little confrontation Crap, with security I can't rewind. yesterday. I stepped in between David Madsen barking all up in Kate's face about something. I can't rewind, guys. She doesn't Crap. deserve that. Of course not. <laughs> Mr. Madsen isn't the most gentle soul. Do you have proof he instigated the situation? My word isn't good enough? <sighs> the one time I choose not to take a picture. Always take the shot. My number one rule of photography. And Max, I promise this matter is being discussed by the faculty. I assume oh, you know about this viral video. I, I want to go back. Kate's freaked Kate out. Is freaked out by all of this. She can't do homework while she's being tormented on a daily basis. What if Kate brought this on herself? She means well, but maybe she doth protest too much. She seems like she's holding back the truth. Have you talked to her? Yes, I have. Yes, I talked to her on the phone today. She needs friends and support now. I just don't want Kate Marsh to become the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? What does she have to do with Kate? With all her missing persons posters around, it's hard not to think of her. I miss Rachel too. But think about yourself, Max. 
Principal Wells told me about what you said happened in the bathroom. Mmm, that was private. That was a private conversation. Not that I wouldn't tell you. This is a serious accusation, Max. So you don't believe me? I would never make something like this up. I hope so, Max. But it's easy to point fingers. If Mr. Dude. Madsen claims you might be a pot dealer as he did, Dude. should I believe him? Listen, should I... Excuse me, Max. Hello? This game, I'm telling you, yes. makes me upset. Uh, okay. Hold on. I have to take this, so just go into class and I'll be there soon. Nah. I'm gonna go into science, dude. Just don't walk in there. Thank you. Let's go talk. Let's go. Let's go. No, no, no. I didn't want to do that. You know what? I'll do that. Whatever. I actually did not mean to rewind, guys. I do apologize. I want it to... Dude, I messed up. Okay, so I did talk to this guy, right? Let me talk to him again. I had to, like, redo everything Hello, I just Zach. did. What's up, Max? It's weird to not see you without your camera. I'm always taking pictures with my eyes. I bet. As long as you don't talk to everybody about all that shit with the sex in Victoria. Uh, I, won't. I won't. That's what Victoria wanted. Yeah. I noticed she kind of set up her own drama. Even if it I'm sorry, guys. It's gonna be a little bit of weird. a replay here. She doesn't have to, though. That's what that's the whole point of the game, right? When she's hot, rich, talented. What more does she need? Anyway, see you at the game Friday, Max. All right, whatever, Zach. Oh no, I did it again. Okay, so roughly back where we left off. Sorry about that, guys. I'm gonna go over to so this action will play out again. Being on a viral video does that. Maybe this is your way of getting attention. Oh. He's really mean, Mr. Jefferson. I can't believe you say that you to just her. don't get it. Just leave me alone. You have to talk to me, Kate. Why? It's all over, like me. Knock off this martyr crap. What do you want from me? I want you to be honest. Nobody believes me anyway. Stop acting so brittle. Being on a viral video does that. Huh. Maybe this is your way. Step in. Ooh, can I sneak up on him, maybe? Wonder why they don't use real skeletons. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Why? You don't understand mine. Nobody does. Nobody. Let me see where she goes. I want to actually see how this plays out. Stop! Don't come near me! Where does Kate go? This is what I want to see. Does she just leave? Ah, dude, she just leaves. Huh. Well then. It's gotta be a photo opportunity somewhere in here, right? Da Vinci was a boss. Let's go. I agree with that. Art is science, science is art. I still think that uh, I'm a firm believer that art raises or grows uh, the next generation, especially the way that we're in right now. I bet if I touch the glass, all these creepy sea critters will pop up. Hmm. Just touch it. This can't be that hard. Or nothing will happen at all. <laughs> Fair enough. Let's see. I'm looking for another photo opportunity. There's gotta be one somewhere in here, right? Speak with Howdy, her. Brooke. Hi, Max. Making your daily rounds? Yeah, pretty much. How is your drone? Miss Grant busted me flying it over the parking lot. Fair enough. She's all jacked up about surveillance bullshit. Like I was spying on Warren's new car. You already planted a GPS on him? I borrowed the one he has on you. I hate to hit and run, but... Don't let me get in your way. So long. I like their little brief conversations. They're kind of like off the wall a little bit, but I like it. Chemistry stuff. Let's look at it. Bring me the brain, Igor. <laughs> Funny. 
good reference there. All right, speak to Warren. Hey, Warren. Are you okay? You look thoughtful yet confused. Maxwell Silver Hammer. Perfect timing. I need help with this chemical experiment. Asking me for help means you're screwed. Have to add either a bit of potassium or sodium. It's up to you to decide, Dr. Max. Let's go with potass, my guy. I'm not sure why you're letting me decide your fate, but go potassium. Potassium it shall be. Yeah, potass, let's go. You get a free hug. Weird science. Wait, did it work? Yes, I am a scientist. Fuck. Okay, I guess it worked. Where's my free hug, dude? Okay, I guess I don't get a free hug. Whatever. All right, let's go to class. Let's just walk past him because that's Excuse him. me, Max. Can you come over here? Sure. You look worried. Is everything okay? Just between you and me? I'm worried about Kate Marsh. That's no secret. Word on the street is that you and Kate had a little confrontation with our security chief yesterday. Uh, what if I say never mind? I stepped in between David Madsen barking all up in Kate's face about something. She doesn't deserve that. Of course not. <laughs> Mr. Madsen isn't the most gentle soul. Do you have proof he instigated the situation? My word isn't good enough? <laughs> the one time Dude. I choose not to take a picture. Always take the shot. My number one rule of photography. And Max, I promise this matter is being discussed by the faculty. I assume you know about this viral video? Yeah, Kate's freaked Kate out. Kate is freaked out by all of this. She can't do homework while she's being tormented on a daily basis. What if Kate brought this on herself? She what means mean, well, dude? but maybe she doth protest too much. She seems like she's holding back the truth. Have you talked to her? Yeah. Yo, I don't like it. Yes, anymore. I talked to her on the phone today. She needs friends and support now. I just don't want Kate Marsh to become the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? What does she have to do with Kate? With all her missing persons posters around, it's hard not to think of her. I miss Rachel too. But think about yourself, Max. Principal Wells told me about what you said happened in the bathroom. No. Uh, that was right. Uh. It did happen. Nathan Prescott had a gun in the girls' bathroom yesterday. This is a serious accusation, Max. So you don't believe me? I would never make something like this up. Yes, I did I change hope my so, answer. Max. But it's easy to point fingers. If Mr. Madsen claims you might be a pot dealer as he did, should I believe him? Listen, should I? Excuse me, Max. Hello. Yes? Uh, hold on. I have to take this, so just go into class and I'll be there soon. Dude. Mr. Madsen just had a had a character flip for me, my guy. I must admit, I don't like him as much. I thought I'd maybe like eavesdrop on this conversation. Oh, wait, wait, wait a second. Oh, guess not. Go. Mm hmm Okay. I'll do that. Yo, Mr. Madsen's cupcake in a little bit over there. See how he's got a little sway okay. to his uh... I know. That makes sense. Alright, whatever, let's go in here. Let's see. What's Stella looking at? I guess I'm out of time to turn in a photo for the contest. Irony. Hmm. I could have probably turned in a photo. Even in pictures, the forest around here always looks mysterious. Alright, I've already seen the camera. Let's see what Elisa... Oh, photo. Let's go. I'm trying to take as many photos as I can in here. Speak to Not her Not now, Max. I'm contemplating shit. Okay, well, fair enough. I think he knew that I was there. Wait a second. Rachel Amber Hart forever. Hayden's taking a picture. No time to talk, Max. 
posing in progress. That's hilarious. I'm kind of doing something now, Max. No, dude. Nobody wants to talk to me. We're taking pictures of Dana. No time to talk, Max. Art in progress. What is this? So cool to see Mr. Jefferson's actual published pictures. Nice. Gives me hope. Like anybody does. Max is such a Sing little... It. Shh, I think she can hear us. Better be quiet, Not Victoria. these two. We have a master snitch and liar here. Did you think we were best friends forever or something? Not at all, Victoria. Max is such an attention whore. You would if know. If you say so. Can I sit down now? Oh, please do. Take a selfie of this moment. Yeah, Max. So I won't forget you. Two Assholes. spoiled rich kids hanging out together. Let's go. I feel like sitting down right now is a trap. Will it progress the story if I sit down right now? I still want to go see... Wait, drawing. Wait, why can't... Why can I only see the drawing from this side? Let's look at that. That's a great sketch of Dana. Daniel is the real deal. <laughs> I like that he like does things like this just on his own. All right. So we saw that. Anything else that we're missing here in the classroom? I know sitting down is what's going to be the prompt to like start the next class, right? But just my curiosity hit me. I thought maybe that would trigger something else if I like walked out. Victoria left too for some reason, which I don't know why, but it's whatever. Let's go in. Let's go in and sit down. Let's just start prob- oh, there they are. These two. Again, spoil rich kids. I'm waiting for the- waiting for the bad news to start. There's Kate. Okay, why is David taking photos of Kate? Now this is so wrong and weird. Can I stand up? No? Now won't well, let me stand up. Okay, Warren's here now. What up, Max? What's up? Hey, Warren. I saw Kate earlier and her eyes were puffy from crying. Kate has a lot on her plate. I didn't know what to say, and she, she didn't tell me anything. Okay, I know you love me, but if you're not in this class, beat it. Everybody else, please sit down. Maybe I'll we see have you a later. lot to cover today, and so little time as usual. All right, I so see all the usual in. suspects here. Anybody seen Kate Marsh? I think everybody has seen Kate Marsh by now. Let's draw. <laughs> she... Sounds like you're giggling about a video gone viral. Maybe it involves a student or a friend. I wonder how it would feel to have false images of yourself shot out all over the world for people to judge. Usually. Oh, no. No smartphones in class, Max. Put that away. Just kind of figured that's going to happen. Lee, people need something to judge, so they never take a good look at themselves. We can thank reality TV for some of that. In the end, we can only blame ourselves for participating. Speaking of participation... I guess Kate will miss class now. I'm worried about her. Like Max Caulfield, for example. Who I know can't wait to enter, right? I'm sure you read the syllabus like it was a Harry Potter book, so you must know today we're studying chiaroscuro. That beautiful word about the contrast between light and dark. The shadow play that gives photography such visual power. It's basic yin and yang. Black and white images are effective precisely because of their contrast. Am I actually supposed to be listening Although to this we right technically now? See in Yo! Some crazy shit is going down at the girls' dorm! Zachary, Check it. do not come into my class like that ever again. Listen! 
Everybody remain seated. Nobody listen. Dismissed. Did I miss something there? I think there's probably an opportunity there or something that I actually missed. Huh. Well, I guess we'll see what's going on with the girls' dorm on the next episode, guys. <laughs> My name is Go Back to Play Games. Thank you guys for being here with me today, spending some time with me. Thank you. Again, like, dude, like, it's crazy that you guys actually sit and you watch this for 9, 10, 12, however many minutes that you've been with me, and I, I really appreciate it. So, thank you guys for being here. I'll see you guys in a little bit, or I'll see you guys next time. Until then, goodbye. Yeah.